Are you ready for the show? Come on. That's enough. Like anything, the more you give, the more you get. You're going to get something really, really nice in just a minute or two. First of all, I want to give a nice round of applause to the opening band, uh, Home Fry Niles. Where is he? There he is, right over there. Sounding great, man. Very refreshing. I'm waiting for you to come here for quite a long time. Very happy. Guy. And I want to also thank the Maui Sugar Mill Saloon for letting us make all this noise every single Monday for... We've done a thousand shows, but we've done about almost 600 of them here every Monday, starting in 2007. Thank you. This is going to be a high point, I'm telling you right now. Um, one, two, three, four, five. One, two, infinity. We have infinity amount of uh, musicians up here. We've never had five horn players before, and you're going to find out why. I already did. No, you're going to wish that we had five horn players on every show. In fact, the sixth horn player showed up, and I had to shoo him away because he was heading towards the stage. Alan, I had to get him out of here. That was going to be a crisis. Anyway, I'm going to uh, do what I do best, and I'm going to get off the stage. But before I do, I want to uh, I want to give a shout out to uh, one special guest artist that we have that's hidden back here. But hopefully, he's tall enough; you might be able to see a little bit of him. A legendary bass player. He played on the original recording of The Thrill Is Gone. Yeah. Mr. Jerry Jamak. Jerry Jamak. Yeah. That's it? Okay. If you... This is a gentleman that is worth Googling, for sure. Because he's played with Aretha Franklin and so many other artists, so uh, Google him when you get a chance. Jerry Jamak. Um, I'm going to get off the stage, but before I do, I want to introduce the artist uh, that I've, I've known for about 10 or 15 years now, personally, and it's always very, very special when we have him here because he is pretty much the, uh, we might say the number one blues artist in Southern California now, originally from Texas. Roy Gaines is in the house. Let's bring Roy Gaines up here. And as he's making his way... I will say my last few words here. If you've never been here before, uh, this is how we this is how we roll. This is how we keep it super high level. Give it up for Roy Gaines. He's making his way to the band stand right now. Yeah, this is how we roll here. There's two elements that keep this thing going on a high level, and that is uh, the email list. I will go around with the email list. If you're not on there, please get on there. I've got a lot of special things coming up. Uh, we, we just added New Year's Eve, which is on Monday, by the way. Uh, Philip Sace will be here. Blues Rock Sensation, Philip Sace. We do all sorts of blues here. Blues Rock, Soul Blues, all sorts of stuff. Traditional, this is the Texas uh, blues that you're going to hear tonight, which is, uh, this artist is second to none. And most importantly, ladies and gentlemen, this is how we pay the band. I go around with a little jug. Everybody loads it up. We always ask for $20 per person. I happen to think the show is worth far more than that. If you want to throw in more, you may. Um, but please, nothing below $10. That would be tremendously helpful. Thank you. I'll go around with the email list and the jug at the same time. Thank you in advance. We are celebrating. Let me just grab one of these here. We put this show together because we are celebrating... Uh, a record release, CD release called Live at the Saturday Night Fish Fry. This is a uh, primarily a T-Bone Walker celebration. He's going to be doing a lot of his own original music and a lot of T-Bone vintage uh, Los Angeles West Coast and uh, Texas style blues. Nobody plays this stuff better than the legendary Mr. Roy Gaines who is great friends with T-Bone Walker himself. So ladies and gentlemen, I'm going to turn it over to one of the greatest blues legends of our time. Give it up for the great Roy Gaines. Come on. Yeah. 